Hey guys, Supernatural Bookie 10 here, and today I will be reviewing How to Marry a Millionaire Vampire by Caroline Sparks. So I will start off by reading the back. Roman Dragonesti is charming, handsome, rich. He is also a vampire, but this vampire just lost one of his fangs, sinking his teeth into something he shouldn't have. Now he only has one night to find a dentist before his natural healing abilities close the wound, leaving him a lopsided eater for all of eternity. And the second part is, things aren't going well for Shanna Whelan, either. After witnessing a gruesome murder, she's next on the mob's hit list. And her career as a dentist appears to be on a downward spiral because she is afraid of blood. When Roman rescues her from an assassination attempt, she wonders if, she, if she's found the one man who can keep her alive. Though the attraction between them is immediate and hot, can Shanna conquer her fear of blood to fix Roman's fang? And if she does, what will prevent Roman from using his fangs on her? That's the summary from the back, and it's a very good plot line. Very, very good. I give this book a 5 out of 5. Um, it's serious at times when it needs to be serious, like when he's rescuing her. That's a very serious point, but it's also very informing. Um, but there's also funny parts, like when he loses his fang. That's pretty funny. I can't really say without spoiling it, but you guys will find out why if you read it. Um, and then there's, of course, the romance aspect, where they fall in love, and pretty sure you can find out what happens by looking at the cover. Um, it's just, all in all, a great story. And it's about 400 pages. It's a very light read. I finished it about a week I think so yeah and I don't really read too often because of school but in the summer I do um so yeah I think Roman has to be one of my favorite characters in the series this is book one of the love at stake series by the way and I will put Carolyn's website in the description bar so you guys can check it out um the way she portrays vampires is pretty unique and I honestly find it very um, interesting. Just she makes you fall in love with each and every character because she like tugs at your heartstrings and she just sucks you in. You know, her writing just makes you want to read more. Like after I finished this, I literally went out and bought the next three books that night. It was so good. I wanted to find out what happened with her other characters. Um, so yeah, this book is very, very entertaining, and if you want a light read, but that's also supernatural, these books are a way to go. Um, I will do a review over book two if you guys want. That one's called Vamps in the City. Just depends. Or I might just skip it. So yeah, guys. I hope this wasn't too bad for my first book review ever. So tell me what you guys think about it. And also, if you guys would be as kind as to tell me what I could improve on in the future book review videos, that would be great. Because I didn't really know exactly what to say about the books. So yeah, so please help me with that if you can. Or you can send me a message or whatever. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe, and request videos. See ya.